Hello everybody, my name is Caleb. If you saw the title for this video, then you already know what I'm going to be talking about. And with that, I'm just going to get right into it. I'm sick of playing Apex Legends. I'm sick of being forced to play with randoms who have no clue what they're doing. If you don't land in a super safe spot on the edge of the map like Relay or Swamp, 90% of the time your bot teammates are usually dead off spawn. And then as soon as they die, they start to spam the ping and yell at you over the mic till you grab their banner. But you can't do anything because it's the start of the game and you haven't had any time to loot at all. So all you have is a Mozambique and a P2020. But the teammate continues to spam the ping. So you run over to grab your random teammate's banner. And by the time you get over there with your P2020 and Mozambique, you get lasered in the back by a guy with the R301 and a purple body armor. So it's back to the lobby to try the random teammate simulator all over again. It's because of games like which I just mentioned that I can't believe that Respawn hasn't added solos yet. In fact, they haven't even added any new game modes into Apex Legends yet. And I don't think they're going to be adding a new game mode in Apex Legends for a very long time, considering how slow Respawn is with adding new content. It's been two months and all they've added is one character and one new energy weapon which people are mixed about and a very disappointing and sad battle pass. This game has a major issue with the lack of content. Their plan for new content in Season 1, which Season 1 lasts for 90 days by the way, is to add one new weapon which has been leaked. It's called the L-Star. It's supposedly going to be a care package weapon so you won't even be able to use it that much. And add one more character called Watson which was also leaked. That is Respawn's entire plan for new content in Season 1. That's why players and streamers are leaving Apex Legends because this game is boring and there's nothing to work towards. Battle Pass doesn't add anything new. They haven't reset the level with the new season, so level means absolutely nothing. The game has nothing to progress towards, and with no new content being added to the game, there's no reason to keep on playing Apex Legends. The only content they do add is a new character or weapon skin once or twice a week for a ridiculous $18 a piece, biggest scam and waste of money ever, and instead of putting the money they get from ripping off people back into their game to fix it, they decided to add a garbage battle pass for $10 that consists of two ugly skins that they know are garbage but wanted to force people to buy them. I'm not optimistic that Respawn will fix this game in Season 2 either. They need to do a lot more than just add a new character and a crappy gun to stop people from leaving this game. If they really want to keep people interested in this game by Season 2, in my opinion they need to do a lot more than what they're doing right now. They need to add at least two more characters, a few new weapons, a couple of new game modes, a new map to help them make the experience feel fresh again, fix the hitboxes because people are sick of hitting shots and not registering and losing because of it, and lastly, reset the level and introduce a new battle pass worth grinding for so players actually have a reason and an incentive to play your game and have something to work towards. Unfortunately, I don't believe Respawn will do any of this. I don't think they're going to do what they need to do to save their game, and that is why Apex Legends is dead. My name is Caleb, and I'll see you guys in the next video.